after every storm, you go out and you look over the fence to see how much more is gone. 92-year-old Joyce Peach has been living in this home since 1963, located on what's now become a cliff in the small town of Port Morion on Cape Breton Island in Nova Scotia. I'll be here until, until the end. On the weekend of her 90th birthday, Hurricane Dorian hit. Sitting in there on my chair, I could actually see that wall open. That's how strong that wind was. These days, it's not hurricanes, but unseasonably mild winter weather that's making it easier for her backyard to erode. Nothing is freezing up anymore. There's no frost in the ground. She says she's leaving here feet first, so who am I to, to tell her different? Uh, uh, this is her home since 1963. Joyce's son, Stan, says that the pipe that hangs out now dangling over the cliff, he can remember his father digging the drain for that pipe. The fence has been moved in about four times since I've been here in 63. This property at one time was 70 feet wide by 120 feet back. You know, now it's 70 by 50. This Cape Breton University professor says the problem is that beneath Peach's house are unconsolidated sediments that are loose with nothing holding them together. One of the big problems with winters like this one is that the sediment and the water in it doesn't stay frozen. So in most years, if you have water that's in the cliffs and it's frozen, it holds them together. But this year we've been up and down over zero degrees in both directions a lot. When the water melts, it wants to go to the ocean, causing extra erosion, something Peach's insurance company is taking note of, saying now her oil tank is even too close to the water. They've given her until June 28th to move it or they're going to cancel her insurance. As for Joyce, she maintains she's not going anywhere. I am planning on staying here until the end. I have no intentions of moving. I think she might be telling the insurance company where to go. For now, when big storms hit, she's just planning to do what she's always done, hang on tight.